And climate extremes on the moon led NASA scientists to a remarkable discovery that opens up even more possibilities to quench that thirst for lunar exploration. CTV's Vanessa Lee on the moon's mysterious water path. Aboard the brightest object in our night sky, scientists have discovered water beyond frigid and shadowed craters, previously thought to be impossible. The sun presumably would make it evaporate and disappear, but this is a place that gets plenty of sunshine, and so it's very surprising to find water there. It's too soon to know whether the water is accessible. For now, it's not abundant. The equivalent of 12 ounces, or a bottle of water, per cubic meter of lunar soil. In comparison, the Sahara Desert has 100 times that amount. Still, it's considered to be critical for deep space exploration. We can have water and sunshine at the same time, which opens up possibilities for extracting that water, but also for using solar power to power things. So there's a lot of excitement here about the possibilities that this reveals. The breakthrough discovery was made using SOFIA, the world's largest flying observatory. The modified Boeing 747 jetliner rises above 99% of the water vapor in the atmosphere and scans the moon's surface. These findings could change the way future missions work and the terrain astronauts will explore. Potentially, this could be a source of water for fuel, for obviously water that they can drink, and indeed oxygen for them to breathe. So it's a big resource implicator. Learning all about water on the moon will be a key part of NASA's upcoming exploration. The Artemis program plans to send the first woman and the next man to the moon by 2024. Vanessa Lee, CTV News, Montreal.